Okay, ah, bo bo bo. Okay, ta table twenty shows some value of the variable x and y. Okay, so it is given that y varies directly. Okay, so kita buat dulu y varies directly with the cube of x. What does it mean by the cube of x? X cube lah, isn't it? So it's given over here y equals to eight. So you are going to have your value of k. Uh, so we are going to have over here y equals to k x cube. So means that we are going to have over here k equals to y over x cube. So you are going to play a replace, a uh, substitute with the x value with four. And y value with 8 first. So, you're going to get 8 over 4 cube. So, 8 over 4 cube, you are going to have? 0.125. 1 over 8, I think. Uh, okay, 0 0.125 also can. Okay, 1 over 8 also can. So, now, our job here, we are going to find our value of m, which is our x, isn't it? So, I'm going to substitute back the value of our k there. So, our y here with 8, uh, sorry, 27 equals to, okay, wait, 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 wait sorry. Ah, yeah, 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 betul lah. <laughs> 27 equals to k here is 1 over 8. And we are going to times with m, isn't it? Am I right? Ah, M cube. So, yeah, thank you. M cube. So, what happened here? We are going to bring 1 over 8 to the left. Uh, so, 8 times with 27. Am I right? Okay. So, you are going to have over here M cube equals to 27 times 8. What do you get? 200. 2, 1, 6. So, we are going to find for the value of M. So, cube roots of 2, 1, 6. 6. six. That's going to be your answer. Okay. You must find the value of your K first. And then you substitute into your variation. And we are going to find for the value of our X, which is our M lah. Can class any question? None. Okay. Questions number 21. Given that P varies directly as the cube of S. Okay, kita buat dulu. P varies directly the cube of S. S cube. Inversely as the square of Q. Inversely. As the square of Q, isn't it? Yeah. And also, inversely, as the square root of R. Square root of R. Square root of R, kita ada bawah sini, betul tak? Uh. Uh, okay. If the relationship between P, Q, R and S is represented by the equation P equals to K, Q, X, R, Y, S, Z. Where k is a constant, the value of x, y, and z are... Okay, so, apa kita nak buat? Kita nak buat bagi jadi sama macam ni. Betul yeah. tak? Uh, so, we are going to bring our q square over here. So, you are going to write as p equals to k. q over here, you're going to get negative 2. Am I right? Yes. Yeah. And then r here, if you are going to have your... Square root. 1 over 2. So, we bring up here. You are going to get R negative 1 over 2. And S cube here. So, you are going to get your X value is going to be negative 2. Ah, yang tu je lah. A je lah. <laughs> kan? Betul tak? A dapat semua. Ah. Negative 1 over 2 and also 3. So, you are going to have the value uh, the answer here is going to be A. Can class. Next question. Number 22. Given that P3 to P1, negative 4, negative 5 equals to 6, negative 12. Find the value of P. 
Okay, so you are going to have row and column. So means that this one, I'm going to have this one. So you are going to get the value of negative 12, isn't it? Plus yes. P times with 1 plus or minus plus, plus with 3 times with negative 5. Equals to negative 12. Can. So. Ah, ah, okay lah, okay lah. Dia nak bawa belakang, kita bawa lah belakang. But before you bawa belakang, this is what must you do. Ah, so you're going to get negative. Negative 15, bring to the right side. Positive. Positive. So you're going to get over here is. P equals to negative 12 plus with 15. So, P here is going to be 3. The answer here is going to be C. Cikgu boleh tak kalau saya ambil 2 P negative 4? Boleh. You're going to get another equation lah kan? So, still you got the value of P equals to 3. Can class. Okay, 23. Ah, yang ini, I have to do what first? I have to, this one first. Solve for our times here first. Okay, so you are going to get 2, negative 1, negative 3, and also 4. Am I right? The whole thing here. I times first. Then, everything there, I'm going to, to what? Ah, just copy back. Okay, 2, negative 2, negative 4, 1, and also plus with negative 1, 2, negative 3, negative 7. Okay, then, what we are going to do here, we are going to, straight away, boleh tak? Teruskan. Ah, so, 2, minus with 2, 0, minus, I plus with negative 1, so, you are going to get negative 1 is the answer. Mari tengok negative 1. Semua oh, semua ada. Uh, baru nak buat eliminate. Okay, so next. Negative 1 minus with negative 2. Huh. <laughs> so confident, huh? Negative 1 minus with negative 2. Minus minus is going to be 2. Ah. So, negative 1 plus 2, isn't it? Ah, you're going to get 1. 1 plus 2. 2 here. So, you're going to get 3. So, mana 3, 3, 3. We got only A, B and D here. Ah, 3, 3, 3. Okay, next. We are going to go for negative 3 minus with negative 4. Ah. 1 plus with negative 3. Negative 2. Negative 2. Mari kita tengok. Mana negative 2? Ni betul? Salah. Betul. Uh. So, it's going to be either A or D, isn't it? Yes. Ah, okay. So, next. 4 minus 1. 3 plus negative 7. Negative Yes, you are going to get negative 4. So, negative 4 is going to be D only is the answer. Boleh, class? Uh, kenapa waktu saya kira tak dapat? Okay, next question. Number 12. Ya? Yeah? Oh, dapat dah C. Macam mana kau dapat C tu? Okay, express. A plus 2 over B minus A minus 3 over A, B as a single fraction in its simplest form. Ah, simplest. Okay, what must we do first? Ah, because this one minus. If minus for fraction, you must look at our, our what? Ah, ni. Ah, pandai. So, is it same? No. no. So what? Ah, okay. The first uh, fraction you are going to times by by a. So everything here we are going to times by a here. 
So, we going to get A square plus with 2A. Okay, so you are going to get over here is minus A minus minus is going to be plus 3. Am I right? Over AB. Boleh tak, kelas? Tu negatif-negatif. Kan? Terus masukkan tak payah tukar. Apa masuk awak? Maksudnya tak payah tukar. Tak, negatif ni untuk semua ni. Oh, ya ke? Yelah. Okay, so what must we do here? I'm going to... Ni, like terms. Kan? Oh, careless. Saya careless. A square... So, 2A minus A, I'm going to get A. plus A plus 3 over A, A. B. Finish. So, E, 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 jawapan dia? C, D, E. Ha? C? Oh, enggak. D. <laughs> Can, class? Can. Can. Oh, lepas tu dia cakap C sebab minus. Ah. Careful, careful. Careful. Can, class? Nasib eh, yang ni dia tak suruh buat apa? Tertarization. Hmm. Tertarization lagi lah. Okay. Next. 25. Given that P equals to 1 over 2 plus Q over 3. Express Q. Ah, dia nak Q ni. Plus. In terms of P. Means what happened here? I'm going to do what here first? Everything here. Saya tak nakkan 2 dengan 3 dulu. Oh, you nak sama kamar awak dulu? Uh, for my, for my, for my, for my opinion, I'm going to times everything with 6. Why? Okay, look here. Why I choose 6? Because I have over there is 2 over 3, isn't it? Isn't it? So, if I times over here with 6, and times over here with 6, so you what, what you are going to get over here, P times 6, you're going to get 6P. Am I right? Am I right? Okay, now you are 1 over 2 times with 6. What do you get for this one? Yes, you are going to get 3. Okay, plus. The other one you are going to get Q over 3 times with 6. Uh, you are going to have over here as 3 and 6 is 2. 2 times Q later, isn't it? So what I'm going to have over here as the equation. Without fraction. I'm going to get 6P equals to 3 plus with 2Q. So just now, what the person asks is going to be express Q. So means that I'm going to leave alone Q here. So what happened to our 3 there? Time? Huh? Ah, this one minus. This one 2 become <laughs> Divide. So you are going to get your Q here is going to be 6P minus 3 over 2. So which one is going to be the answer? 25 here is going to be D. Can class? Oh. If you are going to make that one uh, same, also can lah. 2 uh, times 3, 3 times 2, uh, same. Boleh juga sebab dia pecahan kan yang tu sebelah kanan tu. Next. Can I proceed? Can, can, can. Okay. Next one. Okay. Given our two triangle M and N. Okay. Given that the height of triangle M is 8 cm. Okay. Dia tak ada dekat sini. Kita lukis lah. The height. Haa. Ah. Huh? Oh, <laughs> 8 cm The area of triangle M the, And triangle N is the same huh. Dia dah bagi tahu dah Sama So ah, uh, How to get area girls uh, Time the The base uh, tapak. 1 over 2 
times with the base over there is going to be 5p plus 9 times with the height. That's for our M. For our N, you are going to get 1 over 2 times with 3p plus 8 times with 12. Am I right? Yeah. So what you are going to do here... Okay, first thing first, to N8 here, I'm going to get 4, can? Yeah. Okay, and also for this one, 2 and 12 here is going to be 6. Can class? Okay, so I'm, uh, what we have just now, it's saying that the area is going to be same. So you are going to put both of our area here. Which is, you are going to get 5P plus 9. Uh, did you want to uh, expand straight away? Yes. Right. Uh, means that I expand. Uh, now, what does it mean by expand here? I'm going to times inside the bracket. Right. So, 5P times 4, you're going to get 20P. Plus 9 times 4, 30. 36. So, you are going to get equals to 6 times 3P, 18P. 6 times 8, 48. So, over here, can class? Okay, because we have what? We have M equals to N. So, next, I'm going to bring 18P to the left side. And I'm going to bring my 36 to the right side. So, you are going to rearrange back over here. 20P minus 18P equals to... 48 minus 36. So, 20 minus 18? 2P. 48 minus 36? 12. So, I want to find my P. 12 divided by 2. So, you're going to get 6 for your value of P. Can class C here? 26 C. Okay, next, 27. Can I proceed? Yes. Okay. okay, indices, isn't it? Yeah. Form? Form 3. Form 3. Ooh. Yeah, form 3. Okay, what well, we have the first one over here, 27 M cube. What you got there? Hmm. Uh, the first uh, in the bracket, in the bracket. Can I can I solve in the bracket here first? Okay. If I want to make it into one equation, means that n six there, I'm going to bring up, isn't it? So uh, you are going to get over here twenty seven m cube and n negative six. Am I right? Okay. So I'm just copy the uh, one over three over here, divide by m square n cube. Okay. What happened next? When you have indices outside from the bracket over here, you are going to have for the number, for the M, all the base. All the base. What does it mean by 1 over 3? For the number. Cube roots. Cube roots of 27. You are going to get over here 27. Actually, you are going to get 27, 1 over 3. Isn't it? Uh, but we know already that when we have 1 over 3 for our indices, for the base of, for the number there, so you are going to get cube roots. Just now, we have 1 over 2, isn't it? Tadi kan? Soalan nombor berapa tadi saya lupa. Ha. Okay. But what happens to our M here? For our M here, you are going to get times. 3 times with 1 over 3. So you are going to get M only, isn't it? Negative 6 times with 1 over 3. Negative 2. Can class? Okay. So 27 over here. For 1 over 3, you're going to get 3. Am I right? Cube roots of 27. 3. Okay. So I'm going to get. Oh, kenapa tak salin balik ni? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Ya, 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 ya. Ya. Eh, M saya hilang. Ya Allah. Ha. Kena makan dah. Sekejap. Tak nak padam. Apa ni? Apa ni kita? Tak ada apa-apa. And negative 2 eh? And tu tak ada negative. And tu tak ada. And tu kuasa 1. 3 dengan 6? 3 bahagian. 3 bahagian. 
Dia jadi satu. Dia jadi satu eh? Dia jadi satu. Eh bukan M. 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 bukan N. Oh, saya punya N ni hilang. Alah hai. Ya Allah. Ha, betul lah negatif dua tadi. Okay. Jangan stress. Relax. Okay. So, we are going to take our M here. Which is our M same base. M with M here. When it become divide here means that 1 minus with 2. So, your M here become negative 1. Negative 2 and also negative 3. You're going to get N here is negative 5. So, we are going to rearrange back for our base with negative indices. Isn't it? Betul tak? Yeah. So, you are going to bring down. Isn't it? Make it a fraction. You're going to get 3 over M and to the power of 5 there. Yay? Yay. Uh, 27 yay. Done? Okay? Okay? Okay. Oh. Stop. Huh? Apa tu? Kejut. Okay. List all the subset. What does it mean by subset? Everything in our set Y. Isn't it? Okay, of course. You're going to get what here? 1 and 8. Everything with our answer there is got 1 and 8. Am I right? Am I right? Okay. So, if you look over there, okay, is it 1 and 8 also our subset? Here, 1, 8 here. Is it going to be our subset? Yes. 1 also yes. 8 also yes. 1, 8 also our subset. And one more thing. We have over here. Null set. Set. Uh, set kosong. Uh, null set. Is it going to be our subset also? Yes. Yes. Set kosong ada dalam mana-mana set lah. So, the answer will be D. Uh, eh? Can class. So, no. Okay, next one. Oh, form 1. Isn't it this one? Form 1. Linear uh, inequalities. This is form 1. Okay, first, you are going to do the first inequality, this one. First, you have to find the value. Okay, so how? How? Kau kira buat belakang. Dia apa yang nak buat belakang? Ah, because we are going to make as a fraction. So, you're going to get 2, uh, two, uh, two x minus 3 less than 15. Ah, Next. Okay, so is it our inequality sign going to change? No. It's going to change only when? If you are going to divide all times with negative number. Divide all times with negative number? Yes. We are going to change our inequality sign. If this one, negative 3 only, they are not going to be changed. So, you are going to have over here is 2x less than 15 plus 3, you're going to get 18. So, next, we are going to bring 2 here, 2 the right. Also, we are not going to change. You are going to have over here x less than 9. Boleh? Okay. The second one. Negative 5x plus 6 less than and equals to 1. So, I'm going to have my plus 6 bring to the right side. Straight away, you are going to get negative 5, isn't it? Yeah. Am I right? Yeah. Uh, so, remember back. Ah, uh, ini kena tukar. Why? Yes, if you look over here, this is negative 5 times 
If we bring to the right side, you are going to divide. Just as I say just now, if times or divide with negative number, so our inequality sign will change. So you're going to get over here x more than and equals to negative 5 divided by negative 5. 1. Okay. So how did we want to know all the integers for x? You are going to what? Draw the number line. Remember number line? Yes. Uh, first of all, you are going to get 9. You are going to get 1. So, X more... Okay, kita buat less dulu, sorry. X is less than 9. Buat bulat, kena gelapkan tak? Yes. Tak. So, it's going to be on the left. X more than and equals to 1. Ha, this one kena gelapkan. Because 1 is going to be include, included. More than. So, the value for our X is going to be start from 1. Yang ini dah salah dah. C and D. Apa pilih C and D? Bye-bye. 1 is included. 9 not is, is included because less than 9. If you look in our number diagram also, Number diagram. Number line also, kita tak bulatkan dia. So, not included. So, if you look over here, 9 is not included. So, the answer will be? Yay. 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 Can class. Can. Kenapa senang sangat, cikgu? <laughs> ah, this one. What must we do? This is going to be? Ah, expand. Okay. First thing first, I'm going to expand this one first. And then the second one also, we are going to times here. So, first thing first, I'm going to do here 3 plus 2x with 3 ta uh, plus 2x. So, you are going to get 3 and 3, 9. 3 and 2, 6x. 2 and 3, 6x, 2 and 2, 4x. Ada ramai yang tak suka buat macam ni. Come again? Ah, 4x square, yes. Ramai orang tak nak buat macam ni sebab apa? Dia kata, leceh lah cikgu, panjang sangat. Saya nak buat uh, terus saja, boleh. As long as, tak ada mistake. Uh, sebab ada orang buat mistake, why? 3 square, 2x square. Dia buat macam tu je. Faham tak maksud saya? 3 square, plus with 2x square. Dia buat macam tu. Betul tak? Salah. Salah dah. Uh, okay. Be careful. Okay. So, this one you are going to get 9 plus with 12x plus with 4x square. Okay. So, next things I'm going to have for our minus 4x times with x, you're going to get negative. Negative 4x square. Negative 4x square and also plus 4xy. Isn't it? Isn't it? Uh, so, straight away Kalau tengok dekat sini Plus 4x square and negative 4x square Hilang So, you are going to get 9 plus 12x Plus with 4xy So, the answer will be Der Ye, ye, ye Can class Okay, next Number 31 Diagram 31 shows a graph that has loops and multiple edges. Which one is going to be our loops here? At J and also L here. Okay, multiple edges is going to be at our KJ here. This is going to be our multiple loops. Huh? Okay, which of the following is the set of edges for the graph? Okay, so... If you look over here, we are going to start with our JJ. J to J and J to J. Am I right? Yeah. So, you are going to get JJ. And then, from DJ also, we can get J to K. JK and KJ, isn't it? Uh -huh. ah, it's going to be like that. JK. JK also can, KJ also can. Bolehlah JK, sama je. Ha, sama je. 
Okay, uh, because we supposedly we don't have the the, 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 the direction here. Okay. Okay, it's gonna be two way here. Okay. Then KL. Okay, KL. Lepas tu? L L first. Ah, L L and then J L also can. So you are gonna get six over here. If you look, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, why does D is wrong? J J L L J L. Sepatutnya? Ah, dia ada dua ni. Okay, okay, okay. Saya pun tak nampak. Ah, JL. Two times JL. No JL. JL is going to be only one way only. Satu jalan je. One edges. So, the answer will be B. Can class. Okay. okay. Next, 32. Diagram 32 shows an undirected and weighted graph. The weight represents the distance in kilometer. Calculate the difference between the longest and shorter distance in meter from point A to point E. Okay. So, shortest, uh, kita ambil longest dulu. Longest, of course, we are going to have A to C. And then? Longest A, B. Huh? A, B? Oh, ya, 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 kan? Ha, A to B, B to C. Ah, betul. Ha, because 7, 7, 14 lah kan? Situ. Ha, betul, betul, betul. Okay. A, B, C. And then C to D is going to be 7. D to E, isn't it? So, here you are going to get 7 plus 7.7 .7 plus with 7 plus 3.5. What do you get? 95 25.2 Okay That's going to be the The longest Okay, shortest Ah, Straight away you're going to get A to C to E Straight away Okay A, C, E Okay, so A, C, E 9.8 plus with 5 Is going to be 14.8 So if we Find the difference here. You are got ah yes. A C A C B F E. Oh okay. A C is going to be nine point eight, and then C to B seven B to F, and then oh banyak. 25.7 Okay So, ah, uh, that one is the longest lah yang tu Yeah, 25.7 eh 9.8 plus 7.7 plus, uh, plus 6 plus 2.2 25.7 Oh, yang tu longest Ada lagi yang longest? <laughs> Only that one, right? Uh, so, this one is not the longest. So, you are going to get 25.7 is the longest. So, to find the difference here. 25.7 minus 14.8. 10.9. So, the answer here, 32 is? Eh? Oh, in meter. Okay, so you are going to get times by 1000, isn't it? Uh, so, it's going to be A, 32. Kan? Ah, tambah markah ni. Boleh, 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 boleh. Oh, yes! Ah, bukti, bukti. Ah, bukti kat rumah esok lah. Esok ada match, tak ada. <laughs> ah, okay. Next! Eh, habis dah? Mana? Ada lagi. Okay. Diagram 33 is a pictograph showing the number of tourism uh, who visited Bangkok Island in March and April The number of visitors in January and February are not shown Okay, total of 55,000 tourists have visited Bangkok Island in those 4 months The number of tourists in January was 2 third The number of tourists in February The number of tourists in February was uh, Total is 55,000 So, mula-mula kita kena tolak Tolak dengan berapa sini? 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, a, 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 nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Twelve times with two thousand five hundred. Twenty thousand. Twenty thousand. Thirty thousand. Thirty thousand. Okay. So we have thirty thousand. So if we have just now that we are going to have a total of fifty-five thousand, means that I'm going to. Minus so fifty five thousand minus with thirty thousand, you are going to have twenty five thousand. Am I right? Yes. Am I right? Yes. Okay. Now, the number of tourists in January was two third the number of tourists in February. What does it mean? Dua pertiga. Ah, yeah. Dua pertiga dari na ah uh, February. Betul tak? So did we know the number of tourists in February? No. So we are going to have what there? Dua ratus lima puluh. Ah, two over three, isn't it? Two over three from the two thousand five, five hundred or twenty five thousand. Twenty five thousand lah, kan? The number of tourists in January was two third the number of tourists in February. So what you have over here, you gonna get. Uh, February is going to be X. Means that the number of tourists uh, in January is going to be what? Two over three, two third, two third from February. For February is going to be X, isn't it? So two over three X plus with X here, you are going to get twenty-five thousand. Am I right? Yeah. Paham tak ni? Because we didn't know the, the 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 number for February, so I put X for our February. So means that two over three from X is going to be for our January, and also for February is going to be X. So now you are going to find for for your X, huh? Ah, what are you going to find X? Ah, what are you going to find for your X? Ah yes, okay. Times everything with three first. So you make two x plus three x equals to twenty five thousand times three. Seventy five thousand. Are you sure? Yes. Ah, so five x equals to seventy five thousand. So can I find my x here? Seventy five thousand divided by five. Fifteen thousand. So your x here is for February, isn't it? So you got already the ana the answer here is C. Can class. So I stop until here first until number thirty three. So ah, ah ah, dah bermasa kan? After this what ah what class? Okay, physics. Okay, that's all for today.